Okay, the Raiders are visiting the New York Jets. Ooh. Last time the Raiders went to New York, they lost. And they had Josh Jacobs, but the, the offense was terrible. It was out of sync. I mean, when I say the Raiders' offense was out of sync, it was so badly out of sync that on one play in the opening drive, you had offensive linemen actually going in opposite directions in one play. It was, it was ugh, horrendous. The Jets are winless this year. Even without Josh Jacobs and John Abraham, the Raiders should win this contest. Will the Raiders win this contest? I think so. I think they will. I think the Raiders will. Because the Jets haven't beat anybody, so there's no reason to suddenly turn around and say, well, I think the Jets can do that this time. Well, it doesn't look like it. Looks like Adam Gase is basically saying, hey, it's my fault. And it's almost like you say, hey, kick me and get me out of here. Something's going on there. Adam Gase had no business getting Teddy Bridgewater out of there and giving the keys to Sam Donald to begin with. I was trying to tell that to Brian Baldinger. Brian Baldinger, Brian Baldinger was telling me, oh, Teddy Bridgewater isn't as good as, you know, Sam Donald. I said, are you crazy? Bridgewater is a better passer. He understands how to run an NFL offense. He already led or was on his way to leading teams to the playoffs and I think they didn't did so. What are you talking about? I, but, you know, he, he had to back the young, big college white guy because... Oh, that's what he wanted to do. And I guess maybe someone told him to do that. You know, because when I brought it up to Baldinger again, who I've known for quite a while now, he kind of backed away from it. Adam Gase did Teddy Bridgewater a favor because Bridgewater now is starting in Carolina making a lot more money. In retrospect, you know. And Sam Darnold is... Um, not doing so well, and neither did Joe Flacco. People look at the individuals, but I look at the system. Adam Gase does not understand how to build an offense that can work, that has a set of simple plays, you know, passing plays that can work under most defensive conditions. A simple offensive set that can be quickly taught so that when you're moving players in and out during a pandemic, guess what? You're not so worried. It's going to be an interesting game. Subscribe to Zinni62 and bookmark oaklandnewsnow.com.